So we have the Skytex, and you have the IMX53. Yes, this is uh, Freescale's new uh, ARM Cortex A processor. It's uh, 1.2 gigahertz. Uh, it's really fast, very smooth. This is just our reference board. We're uh, working on it right now. Um, we're probably not going to release it until uh, summer. Yeah. And we're looking to do uh, honeycomb. That'd be cool. Yeah, that's kind of that's. We want to do an affordable uh, honeycomb tablet. Uh, you know, between uh, 349 and 399 price point. That's Even we're cheaper. Looking. We're hoping. Yeah. yeah. It just depends on how much the hardware costs by the time you know if we can get everything together. But we want to have as much features as, as, as well, yes. like uh, Bluetooth, uh, GPS. All Android tablets should be Honeycomb, right? Yeah, I agree. At this point, uh, you know, it's released and, you know, it's, it's the tablet. So, uh, OS. You, you've been working with Freescale. Yes. Uh, why have you been working with them? Uh, they just offer really good support. Uh, we think we really like their products. They, they uh, have really fast processors. They have a lot of good support on their hardware. And, good value uh, as well? It's a, it's a great value. Yeah, it's a great value compared to, uh, you know, some of the bigger guys there. Uh, they, they might be a little slower in coming out with the releases, but they're really optimized for the OS, and, and so we really like what they've been doing. All right, the software support behind this one. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. a lot of software support. And you also have Telechips going on there. This is on the market yeah. already. Yeah, this is uh, 8902. This is a low-cost uh, Android tablet yeah. we're working on. This one we're looking at, uh, you know, emerging markets and offering that to uh, those customers. So this could be around 149 or less? Uh, around 149 or, or less, we're hoping. What, uh, yeah. what kind of screen? Uh, seven inch uh, resistive screen, of course. Yeah, yeah this is uh, just pretty much bare bones yeah. as it goes. Uh, we also have a, a VIA we're demonstrating. It's a VIA, it's their new 800 megahertz uh, processor with uh, 300 uh, megahertz DSP. It's kind of the same spec as Intelligence. This one actually has a webcam, unlike a lot of the cheaper. Uh, yeah. Uh, Android tablets. And how much is this? This one, around the same price. Uh, yeah. Around that same price point. Uh, we're offering these as like a, a more of like an OEM type of situation. Yeah. All right. And uh, yeah, it's not too bad. Where are you selling? Uh, right now we're just selling in the U.S., but we're looking at opening channels in uh, in Europe and uh, Asia as well. All right. And uh, so. Uh, Telechips is making ARM Cortex A8 as well? Yeah, it should be uh, probably released within the next couple months. And yeah. uh, we're looking into doing maybe uh, one of their uh, you know, unit using that, that Can processor. you say VIA is doing something like that? Uh, I, don't I don't know, know what I don't know if they are. <laughs> I'm not sure what VIA is right. doing right now. This is uh, the newest one I know from them. How old is that kind of? Actually, it's, it's pretty new. Pretty new. Yeah, it's fairly new. For so them. it's not like the first generation Wonder Media stuff? Yeah, no. It's, it's a newer kind it's of thing. It's a newer one. Yeah, it's still just, ARM 9, right? I believe so. Yeah, yeah, it's ARM 9. It came out. I, it's it's already existing. It's on the market. I know the yeah. Telechips is newer. Seven, uh, I think it's a little better than that. It's not too bad of an experience, yeah. and uh, you get the nice. webcam, which a lot of the earlier ones don't And it actually says 2.2. Two. Uh, this is a new thing for Yeah, it's 2.2. Everything we're going to do is uh, at least 2.2. Yeah. Outward, I think mostly trying to do at least 2.3. Cool. Yeah. All right. Thanks a lot. Right. Thanks for dropping.